the UK has the highest divide of any country that we survey. There's a 34 point gap between high income and low income individuals. 71% of high income earners are trusting of our institutions compared to 37% in the lowest income bracket. So why do you think the trust divide is so great in the UK? And does it have anything to do with local politics? Um, and why are we the outlier across Europe in this respect, do you think? It's a very dismal picture <laughs> yeah. that you paint, and it, it is it is absolutely the case, I, I know. And <clears throat> there are several uh, respected academics around the world who point out that the wider the divide between those who have and those who have not uh, is, is a hugely destabilizing factor. And I think we're beginning to see that in, in this country. Um, and that's why I say that I think we've got some shocks ahead because if that disenfranchised as it were part of the community who ha were led to have expectations that um, they would be looked after by a new sort of um, a government um, who cared about people who live below the poverty line or those who live very near the poverty line and nothing has happened there is going to be such frustration that I think that it could actually uh, become civil uh, uh, un unrest how you begin to deal with this again is very very difficult um, to know i would have thought that i mean this is an area into which i sort of hesitate to stray because it's very complicated but i do think that we probably need um, to look very hard at our uh, election systems our electoral systems because what we need in this country um, what we need now desperately at the moment is uh, we need new parties we need new ideas we want creativity we want a big shape up uh, and i think that um, we also need to put an end to what i called uk exceptionalism 